Hello everybody, this is Moldy from Not So Mainstream Gaming, and finally I have finished the plant classes, unlocking every single variant. So today is the last video on the plants. This is the sunflower video. Uh, as always, if you want to read the biography, just put the video on pause. So right here we have the normal sunflower. Next up is the mystic flower. The power flower. Fire Flower, Mario reference right there, uh, the Shadow Flower, and the Metal Petal. So next up I will show them all off in game. Okay so here we have the standard Sunflower. Now a uh, forewarning, this class is not meant to be a straight up killing class, this is meant to be the support class. So my KD probably will be pretty awful. So, now that I warned you, uh, obviously it takes a lot of hits to even get a kill. So in it, instead of focusing on the killing mostly, you're very fast at reviving. Pretty much the healing class. Alright, the next flower variant, or sunflower variant, is the fire flower. This is as with all the other classes, the lasting effect. So after I hit someone, he will still continue to deal damage. So that probably makes this one of the strongest killing class. And because of that, his uh, magazine capacity is lowered dramatically, especially compared to like the 50 shots that a sunflower would normally have. Uh, though he does get kills and assists a lot easier. Here we have the Power Flower. This is probably one of my favorite looking classes. Oh, the electricity just stopped. That was weird. Uh, this guy, probably one of my favorites because not only does it look cool, but I think that the uh, projectiles fly faster with this one, meaning you don't have to lead your shots as much as the other classes. And uh, because it is electricity, if there is a crowd of people, the damage will spread to hurt every single one of them. This also has, I think, 40 shots as its base ammo capacity. When upgraded, it does hold 50, so it is the uh, standard sunflower ammo capacity. Alright, here we have the Shadow Flower. I'm not really quite sure what this one specializes in, or specializes in. Uh, it's... I don't understand. It... I think it does a little bit higher damage, and it looks cool, but I think that is the only benefit of using this class. Otherwise, its stats are pretty much exactly the same as the standard Sunflower. So I guess if you want a cool looking one and you don't like the other classes, this would be the one to use. As usual, killing power is very, very low with these. Um, the biography on this one actually kind of sounds a lot like Batman. So I think that's what they were kind of going for. Alright, so here we have the Mystic Flower. This is when the uh, Sunflower classes actually start to get interesting. Uh, this one is the most different from all the rest. It is semi-automatic. Its shots do a little bit higher damage than just the normal shots. But what is special about this one is that it is a lot like the Future Cactus, which in turn you can charge up the shot and you do super damage. So it is very good in that sense. Uh, I'll respawn and continue playing. Uh, when you charge it up, there are three stages. There's just the standard semi-automatic stage. Fast as you can pull the trigger, and it does the standard damage. Just that right there. Uh, if you charge it up halfway, it does a kind of damaging shot. This is good if you want to get damaged, but you don't want to like stick around and charge it up the entire way. I got 45 
damage on that one. Let's charge it all the way up and see what kind of damage I can do. Oh, I totally missed that. I'm gonna respawn one more time. I really wanted to actually test this out. Also, the uh, explosion animation, just take a quick look at this. Oh, you can't see from that far. It has a cool little explosion. It kind of has the symbols flying out. Yeah, right there. Uh, this is probably one of my favorite classes or variants from this class. Oh, and also when it's charged up all the way, it does do splash damage. Alright, the final class for the Sunflowers is the Metal Petal. This is my favorite Sunflower. It looks awesome. And it conquers the one problem I have with every other Sunflower, is its health. Because it is metal, it has increased health. It goes up by 50, which is very, very, very helpful. Uh, also, damage is normal. The only drawback with this is that its movement speed is slightly slower. And that is due to having the more health. Which, I am completely fine with that. I don't even notice the speed difference. It's just been said that it slows it down. Uh, so, that is all of the Sunflower uh, variants from this class. I hope you all enjoyed. This was the last uh, plant uh, character video that I have. I have unlocked every single plant variant. Up next, I am working on the... Uh, zombie ones but the only problem with that is it's gonna take me a long time I don't have as much time to play this anymore I still will and hopefully get those out the only thing is that I am low levels with the zombies so unlocking all of them is just gonna be time-consuming hopefully I can get those out but I hope you enjoyed these I hope you figured out which sunflowers you want to use they all heal the same it's just preference on looks and slightly different abilities uh, that is all as usual have a great day and see you next time